Hey guys, so way back with another review for you on today, and today I have another Lego Ninjago, this time of the Legacy series. Uh, this one's going to be set number 71700, 127 pieces, ages 7 and up, and I am definitely excited to get into this one. This one's a Jungle Raider, here just showing you a few features, the dimensions, and here's just another one. Also here just showing you like two photo set photos of it being in the show. So I'm definitely excited to get into it. That's going to be the top view on that. Um, but yeah, I'm definitely excited for this one. Um, and let's get into it. Hey guys, alright, and I am back. Alright, so it took me quite a bit of a while to build it actually. I didn't realize how many pieces it had. To be honest, I know it's 127. I didn't realize how much would go into the actual build. Um, these are just a few extra pieces right here. Um, you do get an extra mass for void. If I can zoom in on that. There you go. But, uh, yeah, you get quite a few pieces. I'm not going to go into the instruction book. The book is always the exact same. Um, just explaining always. If it's not the hidden side ones, they don't explain the application, but they do explain the Lego life set in case you lose the instruction book, which is really good. Um, move that to the side. So let's start with the minifigure, actually. So he actually comes with one katana. Um, I actually kind of like this build. It's actually a really nice build. I'm glad I got this set. I'm glad I got this version of Lloyd. But here's going to be Lloyd. His printing on the torso and on his belt and legs. And then here's going to be his printing on the back. We can see that. And then he does have a double-sided face. He has that kind of like a smirk. And then he actually has more of a serious face. If I can just lift off his head just a little bit. If I can just lift it off. Sorry. Okay, there we go. So he has a double-sided face. I actually kind of like that. Oh my god, like I, they gave him the hair piece that they actually did. Kind of falls very well with him. Um, so that's the minifigure for him. Alright, now for the build. So this is the build right here. Um, I'm actually kind of happy. I'm really happy with this build. It came out very well. Even though it comes with three stickers, I did not care about the stickers. It came out very well, better than I expected. Um, it does come with quite a few, like good details especially with the, like the blades here on, on the other side also also comes with the blades on front and also comes with a blade in the back so it's kind of a good thing in case if you lose one of them you'll be able to get another one um this was a sticker right here and the two other stickers are going to be on the side right here and over here um i actually kind of like this little feature that they added that it kind of gives it like the kind of hydraulic kind of bounce to it to like go through the terrain and you could do either one um it's just because i added this little rubber piece onto this technic piece right here and once that technic piece kind of collides with it it actually gives you that spring kind of action back to it um you got a little grill piece back there little spotlights on the sides right there you can see that same thing on the other side you got the kind of like hydraulic kind of feel to it with the grill right there um but yeah, I mean, for 127 pieces, I paid about $9.89 or something like that for it. It's a really good set. I definitely prefer it. If I don't have a Lloyd figure, this is the way to go. There's actually a little bit of a feature right here that we can actually fit him. Actually, I haven't put him in there yet. But, oh, before I put him in there, so sorry. All right, that's going to be a printed piece right there. That whole uh, panel right there, that's all printed. That's the only printed piece that you actually get with this set. Um... Not gonna lie, if I had to give this out of like a rating out of 10, mm, I would give it a rating out of mm, actually 10 out of 10. I don't even know why I'm thinking about it. 10 out of 10, definitely. I actually kind of like this set. You get a good amount of extra pieces um, in case you lose something, easy to replace. Um, overall build of this actual vehicle, definitely. Um, even though it comes with one minifigure, I'm actually kind of glad. So that way they didn't bump up the price for an extra minifigure on there. That was not $15.99 for it. It's a really good build. I would definitely recommend getting it. If you don't have a Lloyd minifigure, this is the way to go. The cheapest way to go. But yeah. Uh, 10 out of 10 for sure. But um, I don't even know what else to say. It's a great, great uh, uh, legacy set. Definitely I recommend getting it. Like I said, 10 out of 10. So yeah, I will end the review here. Definitely remember, smash that like button. Subscribe if you haven't already. 
also hit that bell notification that way you know when I post and yeah comment down below let me know what y'all think and I will see y'all in the next video